Can you tell us why negotiation skills are so important? I think it's uh, important for everyone because the reality is all of life is a negotiation. It is not just defined by the kind of job you have and, and whether you're a business person that's always closing business deals or an attorney that's always working on contracts. The reality is that all of us every day get involved in negotiating for our interests or for with people who have different opinions than we do and trying to reach common resolution. So you might be negotiating for salary, for resources, you may be problem solving and resolving conflicts or trying to resolve disputes among colleagues who have different opinions. And getting to a common ground at a common consensus on an issue is really about negotiation and how you um, communicate and, and solve problems with people. If you could give someone only one or two sentences of advice about negotiating, what would you say? The first is, don't wing it. Um, if you're doing a, a, a negotiation of something that has importance to you, come prepared, do your homework, know all of the elements of your side of the deal, but don't stop there. Also do everything you can to understand the, the issues and the, the data on the other side of the deal. That allows you to really negotiate from power and from strength and know what your alternatives are. Know what your best option is if you can't reach a deal, because that ultimately is your walkaway point. Um, the only other piece I, of advice I would give there is that you really have to avoid a scorched earth approach to negotiation. Uh, most of us negotiate within our own institutions, and it's winning is not everything. I mean, if you win at the expense of annihilating the other side, you're really destroying the sustainability of relationships going forward in your own institution. If there was only one, uh, you know, another sentence of advice, it would be that how you negotiate becomes part of your reputation, both in your institution and in your community. And you can be tough if you're also knowledgeable and prepared and fair and have integrity. And make sure that the issue being negotiated is the problem, not the person you're negotiating with. Don't personalize the negotiation. Make the problem the problem. And both and engage the other side as your ally in solving the problem. What resources do you recommend to help individuals improve their negotiating skills? I think uh, there are a number of good books that have been written on negotiation, and I, I, I think it's worth people spending some time reading up on it so that they understand some of the technique. Um, one of my favorites is one of the easiest to read. It's Getting to Yes by uh, William Urey. And the other one, particularly for women, is a book called Women Don't Ask. Um, and it's Negotiation in the Gender Divide, I believe is the title. And um, that's by Linda Babcock and Sarah Lesshiver. And um, I'd say practice. Thank you. Thank you. Very much.